I know, Lou, he is getting very chatty. Look at that. We have a jumping spider with Saltisidae. So from the Black Widow of Byron's to our Saltisidae. It's huge. This is probably one of the biggest jumping spiders I've ever seen. Now, it may not look big because it's on our dashboard, but these guys don't really get that big normally. They're normally tiny little spiders. So for this guy to be this size is ginormous. It's almost like that big elephant bull that was with those with that elephant herd that Taylor had. But these guys have got the most incredible structure where they're able to squeeze their limp into their legs and it basically works like hydraulics and they then are able to jump from one place to another. But isn't he a really cool looking thing? And look at those black and white markings. Isn't that incredible? It seems like it's got an injury to its front leg. You see there, it's almost like the front leg goes thinner. Is the other leg like that? It's no, it doesn't look like it. It's all red there. I wonder if maybe something didn't try to go at him and caused him a little bit of pain. But that is a really spectacular looking individual. I always love jumping spiders. They've got the f coolest faces with those two big eyes in the front. Now, the reason why they have those two big eyes and are not like other spiders is... Oh, there we go. There's a prime example of how a jumping spider jumps. It went from there to gone. Magic trick out of here.